Hello there guys, how are you today? I am back here in uh, Farm Together. This one is going to be short and sweet today. I'm going to be trying to get a bunch of recording done as much as I can the day I'm doing this. I'm taking off here in a day or two uh, and I'll be away for four, four or five days. Um, and I'm, I'm doing some recording ahead. There will be at least one recording up a day. We'll get that much done. But I have not been in this game, as you can see, in three days, and that feels tragic to me. So I just want to have a quick look around. We're going to do a couple of things. That was what the white ones down at the end. Yep. We'll do a couple of bits and bobs. Um, I'm. Yeah, I will have at least one recording up a day. It might be two. It actually, I'm probably going to be able to manage to. I kind of have a bit of a sore throat today, so I'm not really sure. How much recording I'm going to be able to manage today but I'll get as much done before I leave as possible and I'd like to say oh I'm taking a few days away to go camping or hiking or something fun but I'm afraid it's it's just something that needs doing and it, while it won't be you know oh a good time it will be I'm glad that's done so you know that's not a bad thing either right that's it's all good so we're still working on the almonds, the 510 almonds that we will have, we promised to have done for Canada Day on July 1st. We'll absolutely have it done by then. I mean, look at this, we're over halfway. <laughs> It'll be fine. This one's going to take forever. So what do we have to do? I've got, I mean, all of these are... Wow, and I've got all of this stuff. All of this is ready. I wonder how long this is going to be yet. Two days, so. Wow, I have a lot I should actually be doing here, don't I? Dang, already. Like, a lot, a lot. Let's go do, let's go do this at any rate, because it's pretty over here, and I like it. <laughs> this one is not, you know, the sort of the traditional farming experience in this game, where you've got you know, a massive field and you're just clinking up and down the whole time, but I, it's pretty. I feel like I'm in a garden when I'm here and actually, would that be better? No. Is this better? I don't know. Get up a little bit closer to everything, maybe? I don't know, maybe not. Back here you can see it better. Oh, we've got these over here to do too. Lots and lots and lots of diamonds coming in. That's good. That is good because, uh, oh, that the the warehouse. Okay, I had been told in the early days of playing this game that leveling the warehouse, you know, by the old timers, uh, that leveling the warehouse went up to 250 levels. It, it stops at two. It stops at 200. Now, it shows you the next cost and the resources you'll need, <coughs> but it doesn't actually let you do them. So I'm actually done. I thought I still had 50 levels to go, but it, it stopped at 200. So the warehouse is complete. That is as much storage as I can get out of the warehouse. So if I want any more, you know, any more storage than I've currently got, and quite frankly, I did want more than that, um, I'm gonna have to find a place to pack in a bunch more barns, unfortunately. That's too bad. I was really counting on those extra 50 levels, but, uh, you know, it, it was just gone to somebody's big farm, and we'd been talking, and they said, yeah, I, you get 250 levels out of this, la, la, la. And I, I believed it, and it was, it's not, it's not working for me. It's stopping at 200, so it's finished. And I guess, you know, that's all right. That's a good thing. So the, the football club, I'm, I'm really happy with how that turned out. I mean, it's not, you know, I've seen a lot of builds in this game that are a lot better. But I, I like the way it turned out. I've got the little concert area back there, and it's, it's okay. <coughs> oh, gosh. <clears throat> I mean, it's a small community. It's not like we're going to need to fit you know, 62,000 people in at the Astrodome or anything like that, so it's all good. Doo, 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 doo. Oh, it's cool again here today, I'm happy to say. You know, where I live, we've had two weeks ago, 
uh, we were we had a blizzard in the morning. I woke up and I go and pull back the curtains every morning, and there was just a blizzard going on. And then the last few days have been sweltering hot. I mean, it was 38 in my recording room the other day, which is painful. And then when you're streaming and you have to turn lights and stuff on, it goes up from there. It, I've just been almost ill with the heat. It's been terrible. And it's broken and it's cooled off and it was, you know, five degrees <laughs> last night. So, yay. Because <coughs> there's no point in having anything between... <laughs> 45 you know it, it's a good range right to pop through a day yeah it's perfect and then people wonder why I hate the weather here <laughs> there's just there's never comfortable could you just give me a nice I don't know 15 18 that would be heaven anyway we get this done and I have a lot of recording to do today and I feel like I'm about to lose my voice that can't be good And streaming today, although Rhino's taking over part of that, so good, yay, yay. So we get some of those done. I feel like I should just get <coughs> all the diamond stuff done at the same time. I just like to do them all. But you know what? Before I do that, let us go over to here. Because the whole football club was a bit of a, a tangent that, you know, kind of went wonky on me. What I had planned on doing out here that day was actually looking through, do I have radish? I have no radishes planted. So those are just ready to harvest. Oh, and I can plant those any season, so that's fine. Okay, so what do I want to use in our, our carnival thing over here? So this, this is how I do things in The Sims when I'm building a new house. I sort of start out with some kind of idea of who the family will be or things they might want um, in their lives. And I just put down a whole bunch of items so I don't have to go looking for them later. I just sort of go through and grab all the things. And then after that, <coughs> I mean, you don't use half of them and that, that's okay. That's absolutely fine. But they're there, you know, and you can remember what they were or different ideas that popped into your head at different times. Um, these things actually will be will be part of the the water world thing I want on one side of this with to go with the pirate ship so some of this stuff will definitely be connected to that sure cannons why not um, What's, I mean, this is a maybe. It's definitely a maybe. Oh, then that would make this one a maybe too, actually. We'll see. Oh, we'll want this. Absolutely. Um, okay, so let's back up here. We've got this. We want this. These, possibly. That we have, that we have. This, it's a circus ball, sure. It might be a thing. We've got that. This will be over here with these. Uh, we've got that and that. We've got these open or out. Uh, another little boot. Tis a boot, a boot, a boot. It's a boot, a boot. Yeah, that makes sense. I'm Canadian, eh? Um, are we seeing anything that's jumping out? I mean, well, we'll want treaties, of course. Can you go to a carnival and not have treaties? I don't think so. There's another one? I don't know. Maybe. Oop, I think I just dumped my water, my dog in the drink there. We'll put this over here with that. What else might we want? I mean, I guess that's a possibility for decorating the water area. Photos, oh, of course, you gotta get your picture taken. You know, you can put the old ancient, the old clothes on and pretend you're a cowboy or a cowgirl and that sort of thing, right? Absolutely. 
uh, we've got different wagons and different things over here. We'll add this to that, you know, for the roadies, the carnies. Probably we'll have a train station in this area. Um, hmm. Outhouses are probably going to be a thing, but I missed grabbing that. Do I want anything like fireworks? Yeah, for sure. <coughs> <coughs> Close off every night with a firework display sounds like heaps of fun and this will go over here I've never used this anywhere and I just feel like I need to find some place where that should go we could have maybe like a little kissing booth thing we'll see a talk tower I don't know you never know maybe with the train station yeah that would be okay um, sight stars watching the stars I don't know maybe some place you can line up and look at things Oh, there is a kissing booth. Well, of course. Toots the dorbs. <clears throat> now I have I had a Santa's village in my other my other place. It was quite cute. I liked it. But do I want to do that again? I don't know. Okay, so that'll be I have never used the little yellow submarine, so I'm actually quite excited about that. This one is unlikely, but possible. So we'll go ahead and put that in. <clears throat> now, I, as far as decorations for this go, I really don't know. I mean, I'll probably need something like this just for, again, queuing up people, you know, that kind of thing. Uh, that can go with my piratey yar place, I suppose. Um, a Roman banner. Oh, balloons. You gotta have balloons. Are you kidding? Of course. All the balloons, right? Absolutely all the balloons. Lighting, that one, this, these. I think we're gonna we're gonna need lots of lighting. It's gotta be bright and shiny and pretty, right? This is a maybe, so we'll go ahead and put that down too. Um There are seashells. I have no idea if there's any reason I'd want seashells, but they kind of go with watery stuff, so just in case. Uh, this sort of thing, an arch for the Poseidon adventure kind of thing. I don't know. Is this a possibility? It's a possibility. Little waves, absolutely. You never know. Uh, two, two, two. What else might I want in this? Not that's not the right place. This one, I think, you know, is an entrance. Lots of stars and bright spangly, you know. Yeah, I'll definitely be using those. More balloons. Um, because you can never have too many balloons at the carnival. And if I could find a place for them, I'd really like to use these floating candles. But I actually, I have no idea what, like, why or where they would fit. I can't, I can't come up with a reason for their existence is the thing. Now maybe, you know, at Halloween or something, we could put bits and bobs out. Now these are kites. Kites are not, not balloons. They don't really feel the same. Would I want this around the outside, maybe, of the carnival grounds? That's a possibility. Definite maybe. I'll probably end up wanting that for the train. Well, I will, I think, I'm sure. Might as well place you over here, too. <clears throat> hmm. Our flamingos, horses. Two, do, 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 do. There's lots of kites. We've got these done. Is there any place I could use that? Again, I can't think of a an actual reason to put it anywhere, but I don't know. And what kind of, uh, that's a stream. That doesn't feel quite right. A carp, I mean, that's a maybe for pathing. Maybe. What would that look like? 
no, that's not what I wanted to do at all. There, sunshine. Go back and pick this up. Just want to see what it looks like. It flashes. Okay, we might have. I've never used that. I did not know that. I love it. This is quite, um, you know, it's kind of pretty, but I don't know. I think we may just have to go with that. That's pretty fun. Now, we do have the... Um, <coughs> The kissing booth thing, there might be a way to use one of these in all of that. Um, we'll see. I don't know. I'll just put them down for now in case. This is cute too, but I, I don't know. I think we, you know, I might need one of these for watery bits, almost certainly. But I'm kind of, I think, I think we're fine with that. I love the fact that it's all lit up. That looks really nice. It'll be just charming at night. What would it look like doubled? Is it going to be just as weird as everything else is? Yeah. Because if I wanted it, you know, to be double wide, it would look like that. I can't put like flowers in the middle or anything, but I don't know. We'll see. <coughs> Oh my goodness gracious. So this, this is how I start things. And then we'll find a front gate. We'll put our circus tent up. Uh, I had turned this into a restaurant gift shop. I had a gift shop in this front room before and then a restaurant there. And I, I think, you know, I think that's, that's a fine idea. We'll have like the ticket office thing out front and, uh, or you buy your tickets in here or something. I'm not sure how that will work, but I suppose, how can we do this? If we did, this room is good. It mean, this one makes a good restaurant. These others are kind of small for that. I'm wondering if I could do a small, a small cafe on either side sort of thing. The toilets in the back and make this big one, the gift shop. And then this front room, the, um, you know, the ticketing place where you walk in the tent to buy your tickets. I don't know. You have to walk in, walk back out. It's not really like a good flow thing, but but we will have some rides. We will have the train, and it might have its own little train station. There might actually end up being two train stations here. And just so I don't forget that idea, because I kind of like it, you have the main the main train that's part of the tour that brings you into the place, but somewhere down the road, you know, in here in it of itself you've got you know you can take a train ride I like that plan so we're gonna add another train station and then there'll be lots of balloons and lots of lights and shiny and sparkle we'll have a place for the roadies <coughs> the carnies whatever my mom worked in a carnival <laughs> true story <laughs> when she was quite young yeah huh Wait, do we want to give them showers and change rooms? I mean, we'll need we'll need outhouses, that's for certain. I like the idea of using some of this stuff, but maybe we'll just save it for we'll just save it for the holidays and decorate our little town center with those things perhaps. Just play around with holiday stuff for there. Anyway, that's it for today. This is the beginning of the last large project. This is going to be sitting out in here someplace. I still have a little island. I've got some space there. I wanted to put in a couple of more actual farming areas. I don't know. We'll we'll see. But the the carny the carnival's going in here someplace. So this chunk right through there will be our carnival grounds. Um, and oh my goodness, did you see this? I can get I can get more almonds twice in one day. I am flying through this. I thought it was going to take so much longer. <laughs> oh, good Lord. <laughs> Look at this. It's going to be done before Canada Day. I am so excited. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it. I am done like dinner in here. I am going to exit simply because I want to make sure that you see this. You will be seeing this on a Monday. And in three days from now, I won't be here, but I will try to find a way to get to a computer and get this uh, 
and get that event, get something out for that event. We'll see. I'll do the best I can. Until I see you next time, guys. Let's live our lives happy and build them beautiful. Bye-bye.